Now that the hippie wizard has a warrant for arrest, he searches for a team of elite assassins for the mission. Are you ready to go on an adventure? Yeah. Okay. Are you ready to go on an adventure? I mean, I mean, I guess. I mean, my laptop's broken, and I'm all out of coffee. What said that guy stole all the coffee, and apparently this adventure has to do with getting more coffee. So I'm cool with that. Are you ready to go on an adventure? I thought life was an adventure. You ready to go on an adventure? Well, is it like about Minecraft? Like every day, all day, all day? No. Because it's like, what? It's not like Minecraft. I crafted this diamond sword for nothing. Are you ready to go on an adventure? Yes, I'm going deep sea fishing. Yes, I think I might go to England or somewhere like that. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, but then again, France would cause me home to also. You see? So, do you want to go on an adventure? I am from Mother Russia. We do plenty of adventures there. Wait, do junk and hallucinations count? No. Hey, you want some vodka? No. So, do you want to go on an adventure? Well, you know, I'm like the best spritzer in the entire world. Like, look, spritz. Okay, you don't have. See you later, boy. Oh. The team has been chosen, and now must drink the black coffee to be initiated into the great Nazgul coffee cult. You must drink this coffee to be initiated in the adventurers of Nazgul. I go first. You are now initiated. The wizard must now teach them of the importance of their quest. This is the story of coffee. Once was a wizard who had a beautiful garden, but every day he would look at it and feel nothing. Even though the birds were happy, he was not, so he wanted something that would make him happy. So he created coffee and used ancient elfish wording to code the magical bean, such as frappuccino, latte, cappuccino, espresso, and gin-infused wine coffee, which is the oldest and most rare type, which can only be found in the feathers of dodo birds. And as such, coffee was born. There were three parts to a map, which will lead to the holy coffee maker, which was handcrafted by the wizard himself and his name was Sun Pounds. Him and his compatriots all were given a piece and passed it down through their bloodline. And some say they were lost, but some say they were not. Who knows what is true? They now set off to find the last remaining part of the bloodline.
Okay. Oh, Positive what? energy. You want me to do what? An aura. An aura. It's like a little like and, uh, whatever. We do it all the time in our yoga class. Soon after, they decide to make camp, then something strange happens. Hey, how do you go, boys? Go order donuts! Not me. Oh, no, it's not me. I know what you must do. You must eat all the donuts to get the first okay. place of the my up. Guys, I know what we have to do. We have to eat all of the donuts. Yay! Yay! They find a coffee bean canister that says, eat me, and he drinks it. The problem was, is that the coffee bean was so powerful that anything that had touched it would grow inside. He is growing a coffee bean inside of him. There is no hope for him now. He is dead. It has taken over his body. He's gone. <laughs> they are now searching for the antidote, but they will not find it. <laughs> After a while of painful moaning, he finds that the map grew out of his pants. They have the second piece of the map. They seem to have lost their Russian hobbit friend and are mourning his loss. Yeah, I don't know her 
Now with all the pieces of the map in their possession, they try and decode the wording to find the holy coffee maker. So we got the three pieces of the map. Whoa. What, what does, does it say? It says, it's your mom. Right? Over there. Is that no, a picture of a CD? Oreo? Oh, oh, the coffee oh, maker. Coffee oh, coffee yeah. Oh, yeah, it's over there. The whole time? Now they set off on their 15 feet trip to the holy coffee maker to do the coffee chant. Now that they have the coffee talisman that they can use to destroy the Goblin King, they set off to find his throne room. What's that? Dear God! Oh no! Coffee guard! <laughs> we have to fight them to get to the Goblin King. They're a feature breed. Going by the oh coffee bean. The dark coffee bean. I'm not the Goblin King, I'm the Goblet King, the King of Goblets. Wow. Nice. Yeah. Wow. I did great. Had a great trade in the Goblets until that detestable Sun Pound put me out of business. Now I have to sell a lot of Goblets to make up the money difference. Pretty ugly. Hey, I heard that. Sorry. So what can I do for you well, to come into my realm? Think.
of Nazgul. First me. <laughs> you must drink this coffee. You must drink this coffee. You must drink this coffee. To be initiated. <laughs> you must drink this coffee to be initiated in the adventurers of Nazgul. First me. Austin! Holy shit! Are you oh. there? You must drink this coffee to be initiated in the adventurers of Nazgul. Rowan! <laughs> oh my god! Oh no, it's already. <laughs> you must drink this coffee to be initiated in the cult of Nazgul. The cult? Oh my. I just want to tell you guys. <laughs> Call it. Well, 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 that's all, sir.